Alright, so what is good everybody on YouTube? This is your boy B, Bullet RC. I'm coming at you guys again with yet another video. Today, I have been waiting to show you some of this stuff for a while. We got new pickups from Kith and some new stuff from Supreme. Caught a restock on Supreme and fucked up and ordered something on accident when I was trying to get that mini bike. So, I guess we can show the mistake first, but let me just show y'all the stat so y'all know the magnitude of the hole we about to get into. So here is one box, two boxes, three boxes, four boxes, and then to finish it off, y'all already know how we do. We got this huge bag from Supreme. So let me go ahead and put all this stuff down. We're gonna hit the montages one by one and get into everything I picked up. Let's get it. Poop is robotic, I ain't touching. No, looking at your hope because she busting. Yeah. Ryan in that coop with the wings. Yeah. Going to your land with them chains. Yeah. Chain. So let's go ahead and just get this one out of the way. Last week, I was trying to finesse a Coleman mini bike. Didn't get that and accidentally ended up ordering a magnet. So a whole Supreme bag. And you know, Supreme shipping is $10 off rip. So I paid like $20 for a little magnet. Now they threw me two regular box logo stickers, so I appreciate it, but this is the Orgy magnet. And uh, like I said, I was using it to try to finesse the bike, didn't happen, and then I accidentally still went through with the order, so I have an Orgy magnet, a Supreme Orgy magnet. Yeah, so that was the first fuck up. Let's get into the second box. <laughs> I keep it real in it most, I know you're feeling it Cause that's are nice, I like the toes, I keep a spilling it Bone crushes, I keep her close, I got the skill for this On my back, the fly is closed, looking ill and dip Just ask is illegitimate, cause life is still a trick And then you die So getting into the second box, this was actually a cop from Kith About probably a month Probably, yeah, probably about a month ago. You guys know they dropped the Cobra, the Adidas soccer collab release that they did with the Cobra and the Flamingos, the two different teams. Now, I didn't get the A16s. I didn't get any of the shoes. I actually just walked away with one of the pair of the T-Row track pants. I was gonna get one of like the tops, but I just decided to get the pants and just stick with those. So these are like your regular T-Row Adidas track pants or soccer pants, but with the Kith accents, you got Kith right here on the right side, Adidas on the left, and it's just all over flamingo, pink colorway, the drawstrings are blue, of course to go with the rest of the collection. And I got mine in a size XL, I'm usually a 36 waist, and they definitely fit me a little loose. Usually I would either get a large or an XL in these pants. I went with the XL because I just wanted to make sure that nothing changed in sizing. I didn't get it too wrong or too small of a size so I went with the bigger size they are running a little bit bigger than what I would want them to but I'm pretty sure after one solid wash we're throwing them in the dryer they'll be good to go now as far as what makes these special to any other pair of regular Adidas track pants it's just that they go with the collection of course they have kith on them behind the knee you can kind of see this breathable mesh pattern that's a little bit different from the rest of the pants they had the three stripes going down the side and if you're familiar with the t-row pant then you already know what these are all about just a nice lightweight cozy track pants soccer pants to rock and wear and i just thought this was a clean colorway just to pair for the summer pair with some white ultra boots white kicks whatever you want to do good to go Now in this box right here, I actually caught the restock on Supreme. You guys know I was going for the Terry towel like shorts, maybe the tank, and I missed out on both of those. But when the hats dropped, I actually caught a restock and I was able to get the black hat. Now, of course, the best one is that coral kind of peach colorway. That's like one of the best colorways that Supreme drops in anything that they drop. But that one itself didn't restock, but the all black one did. I really like this hat. I just like that terry towel feel. It's a really dope material, and especially how they used it with debossing it and Boston Supreme all over. It definitely looks really good. This is definitely one of those items that's just all about materials and you really can't see what's different about it until you get up close on it and really see the supreme the detail and just the way that is running striped all over the hat this is a really really dope hat i really like what they did really good work on these in my opinion now i wish it wasn't a camp cap i don't wear a lot of camp caps anymore but here and there i make like an exception i would have loved that this was one of their like five or six panel hats been really dope but it is what it is i'm just glad i was able to get this for retail on a restock and i will be looking for those uh coral 
colored shorts the peace joints soon so we'll see what happens with those now other than the hat of course y'all know they just dropped me two more of the regular box logo stickers so that's it for that box let's get into the next one I'ma keep it true, I ain't gassing up a bit Oh, top me up in my well whole shit Three chains on, still ain't by that whole shit I'm a real nigga, you a little bitch I be on my guap, smoking on that jet She gon' have a fit when she see my new bitch He gon' have a fit when he see my new well That one ain't tryna lean when she see the new so in this box right here, I had two new grabs from Kith. It was a collab with Bergdorf, Goodman up in NY. And let me tell y'all, this stuff is like, it was expensive, no flex. It was definitely expensive, but it's more of a, a luxe, cozy feeling. From materials to fit, I mean, it was just overall, I, I thought it was worth it. So I went ahead and spent my money on it and I wasn't disappointed. When I order from Kith, anything, I just feel like you don't have to worry about quality and stuff. Now I actually ordered both of these pieces when they dropped the night of around 12 o'clock, 12 a.m. Um, these right here are the shorts. I think the shorts retail at 165, which is expensive i think i just had gotten paid for doing something i don't know i just got paid so i went ahead spent a little bit did a little splurging the shorts were expensive the pullover were expensive but like i said before these are extremely comfortable they definitely have that luxury feel to them the shorts are what they call a jacket or a custom woven jacket fabric but they really went in with the little details so on the drawstrings of the shorts it has kith in the back they are gold of course and then on the front it says bergdorf goodman then you guys can see this little tag down here what they're saying is metal to me it doesn't really feel like metal maybe a really really thin metal but it doesn't feel like a a lifted kind of like 3d printed on rubber and then that logo itself has its own texture they do have a back right pocket and then two side pockets the pockets are with the gold zips that's on both sides and the back and they do have custom zippers that say kith just a really good fitting short i got these in size xl i'm a size 36 waist and they fit perfect piping going down the side in that really dark deep burgundy color and just says kith and bergdorf goodman now i got both of mine i didn't get the burgundy i would have liked to maybe gotten the burgundy didn't really care for the black colorway but i got both of the olive so i got the olive and burgundy shorts right here very nice luck shorts and then we can move into the pullover which once again bruh the fit the materials extremely clean and they have these same exact details as the shorts just on the pullover the Bergdorf Goodman and Kith logo is on the left sleeve the piping that you see is on the shoulders and then across the front it's like a half zip usually I would call this a quarter zip but this literally goes all the way down half of the front zips down way far but we do still have front pouch pocket right here you guys can see there is a place for your hands and this whole thing on the inside is a pocket you're not gonna miss that now it does come up on your neck almost to your chin and you can't unzip it fold it down if you want to but I really just like the look of this man that really dark olive green with the burgundy and then the gold zippers I think these colors just really work together and then those small little details that they make sure to keep in there just keep the quality going I just really like this stuff so that wraps up all my cops from Kith now the last thing we have to do is get into the big bag of Supreme so let's do it my perfect perfect working Lurking, first whenever I have a family playing all to itself. Mercy, don't hurt me. Thirsty, persons, birthstones, earth. So last up, but definitely not least, up we have our big bag from Supreme. So let me go ahead and take out the first thing I'm going to show you guys right here. I picked this up on the restock, and this was weeks ago like i said i've been waiting to show you guys some of this stuff for a while i was just waiting to get some more in so i can make a bigger video for you now this is just one of the four colorways that i think that they restocked and these were sitting on the site for a while i grabbed the yellow in this one just because i didn't want the black or the blue i kind of wanted one of the weird colors so i think this is called asset yellow it's an all over ripstop book bag and a really really unique color in my opinion that's why i didn't go for some of the regular blues or blacks or i think pink i didn't really care for the pink one but this one's definitely dope in person in hand i really like this really crazy yellow colorway supreme boss logo on the bottom supreme on the outside 3m hits all over and it's a book bag i don't really need to go in it too detailed i mentioned before that all over is mostly a ripstop material so it seems like it is something that's gonna last so all in all it's a nice bag has a nice pop to it i know it's not one of the most 
sought after colors because it is yellow. I feel like this was the last color to sell on the book bag. I, th I thought it was dope though. I like it, looks good, feels good. And then let's go ahead and get on in to the second pickup because you know what I'm saying? We, we got another one right here. Now this is what they call a waste bag, the Supreme Waste Bag. Now what this basically is, is a double XL fanny pack, but it is actually pretty useful in the summer when you're wearing shorts that don't have pockets or you just want to add a little bit of color to your outfit with some type of accessory. You can toss this on, you can throw it on your back, on your front, on your side, and it has a supreme with it. So people, you know, they already know. You, you already know. Now the fanny pack isn't anything new. It just kind of have its own resurgence. People wearing it a little bit differently. We know history repeats itself, fashion repeats itself. And honestly, I didn't know how useful one of these things could be until I was walking around Secret Con London. I was keeping my lenses in it. Uh, I was keeping stuff that I didn't want to just have in my pockets in it, stuff I need to get too fast, money. And it's just actually really, really useful. Whoever invented the fanny pack, Good job. So that is the Supreme Waist Bag, AKA Double XL Fanny Pack. And then inside of this, we have even more stuff. And we have another bag. I guess we can toss this in the background and another tip. So back when I was in Chicago, if you guys watched one of my older pickup videos, you guys saw that I did get the pink Vampirella tee or the Coral or whatever you want to call it. Now I got this t-shirt off of the drop and this is the other tee. Now this is the car tee in the blue. And this one actually looks really good in person. I like this hue of blue that they use. All red Vampirella logo on the left chest. And then on the back you have the huge queen car with Supreme. And then she is on the back. Nice little graphic design. A clean tee and I actually really like the blue. I think it's one of their better prints or better graphics from some of their most recent summer drops. And I was looking to get one of the hoodies. I really like the purple one and I really like the orange hoodie that was uh, the Vampirella joint. So maybe in the future I'll get that all blue size XL, y'all already know. So I picked this one up and I have the pink one to go with it. So I have some of the best colors I would say. I'm not sure if they dropped the cream or off white, but I'll just look into it. And then last up you guys see me wearing it right here is just a Supreme shoulder bag. Now this is the smallest bag a lot smaller than the waist bag joint and this is your smallest option if you want something to hold around you like i said this one is going to be a lot lot smaller than the actual waist bag but it serves the same purpose man you need to just hold something right near you you got it you want to put it on the front you want to put it on the back however you decide to wear it you can wear it and keep it moving this will accessory in the summer when you don't have pockets or you just want to have a bag that's not huge but that's on you at all times you want to keep cash whatever a phone whatever you need to keep in it is actually very 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 useful so that is going to be it for this video much love to all the fam followers and of course supporters so that is a wrap for this video let me know what was your favorite pickup if you got lucky on any of these drops as well let me know what you grabbed down below in the comment section much love to all the fam followers and of course supporters you guys can find me on instagram twitter soundcloud snapchat the snapchat is bull.cb by the way here there blase blood of course and i will see y'all on the next video hey if you enjoyed the video make sure you leave a like if you aren't subscribed go ahead and subscribe and if you aren't part of the notification gang click the bell finesse the bell get notified i'm out y'all be easy peace